Hi guys, Jordan with Motion Array, and I'm going to quickly be showing you how to install our handcrafted plugins for Premiere Pro. Thankfully, it's a really simple process, so let's dive right into it. Once you've downloaded one of our plugin sets, you should be able to find it within the download section of your computer. In the folder, Motion Array Plugin Installer. If you've ever tried installing plugins before, you may have had a challenging experience, so we've made it super simple for you. Whether you're on a Mac or PC, the process is the same. Within the downloaded material, you should see a folder either named Mac or Windows. So choose your option, and then simply double click on the installer inside to start the process. Select which version of Premiere Pro you're on, and then the installation process is as simple as hitting next and finish. And once it's done installing, your materials are ready to use inside of Premiere Pro. If you had Premiere Pro open during this process, we'd recommend shutting it down and opening it back up again. Once you do, your plugins will be located among your other effects and transitions. The plugins that we just installed were transitions, so I'll go down to Video Transitions, and our plugins are located here, in their own designated folder. It's really just that easy. But there's one last thing that you have to do before you start using them. If we drag and drop a transition onto our footage, you can see that it works, but it's got a red X over top of it. This is because Motion Array plugins are linked to your Motion Array account. So in order to activate them, you'll need to go down here to the transition between your clips, highlight it, and then go up to Effect Controls. And then you'll want to click on this little setup icon located here. Once you do, you'll be asked to input your email and password for your Motion Array account. Hit enter and you'll be able to use these plugins to start making your videos look awesome. And guys, I hope you found this quick tutorial helpful. If you did, we also have a whole host of other video editing tutorials to help you out for Premiere Pro, After Effects, and even DaVinci Resolve. Thanks so much for watching, and I can't wait to see what you create using Motion Array plugins.